shower but at the same time i'm shooting body care video for a brand for couture exclusives they sent me some products and i have to make like a mini instagram 30 second video for her so while i do go in the shower i'm going to use the products as well so that's what i'm really about to do um i don't know what i'm really i have a little i know what i'm doing on my agenda today but y'all just gonna follow, follow me throughout my day First things first, I like to say, I'm sorry I just got into it. I feel like we, we, we're connected now. Like, we're really, like, friends. Like, you know? So, if this is your first time coming to my channel, hey, girl, hey, my name is Chalice Crystal. And thank you so much for clicking on my video. I'm happy to have you here. And if you're returning, what's up? And I'm happy that you pulled back up. I love you guys. And thank you for tuning in to see what your girl got going on today. So, let me just hop in the shower and do what I do. Um, I'm about to record, like I said, and yeah, let's just do the damn thing. Uh, so, I just used the scrub. I have more products of hers downstairs, but I decided to pair the aloe vera body scrub and her rose petal body oil together. First thing first, I used this by itself. And my skin was like instantly mad soft in the shower. Like it felt so, so good. Like, look at my skin. It's like so, it's mad soft and it feels like so moisturized. Ooh, I'm so happy. I'm so excited to edit this video because yeah. I, I really love this. This aloe vera scrub. The rose petal. The oil feels good, but I don't like the scent. Like, I don't want to smell like roses, if that makes sense, you know? But this aloe vera scrub, A1. But the, um, besides the smell of the roses, the oil is, like, very moisturizing. It's very lightweight. And I feel like my skin is, like, so glowy. Like, it looks so rich. Okay, so we took our nice little shower. I'm about to do my skincare routine um i should 
actually do my hair first. Because I want to film another video of me introducing another product, which is the Lancome Genifique. I've been Genifique. I just put this into my skincare routine, guys. And this is really what's been having my skin glowy. So I kind of want to use this. I think I should do my hair first. I'm not sure. I think I should do my hair first. So I can take this bonnet off and, you know, actually promote the product really nice with my hair and everything's laid. So let me brush my teeth, do my hair, and then I'm going to come back and do my skincare after I do all that. Girl, I get the money with we'll me to my know. If you love me, every night we make you mad. Not only you give me love, but make me nice, so nice, so nice, so I feel make you mine. Oh, I love you, plus I never make you mine. If I let you smoke, it's you gon' lose my light. Oh. If you pay me nothing, I'ma spend the night. Oh, yeah. Can't get out of my head every day. Time to dance with you, my money I go pay. My locks are growing, y'all. Like, I haven't twisted my hair in about like three months. So that's why I look like that. But I'm getting a retwist tomorrow. I'm actually going. I found the loctician out here. Well, she's a little farther, but she's in Texas. But she's in another part of Texas. So she's about 40 minutes away. But I'm actually going to her tomorrow to get my one year um lock retwist which i'm excited about <laughs> It's like so, it, it makes your face super clean and it's like not harmful. Like you get your skin to sting or anything like that. Um, it's so lightweight, but it gets all the dirt and everything out, if that makes sense. Um, keeps your skin super, super clean. Uh, you can put it over your eyes. That's what I like too. You can put it over your eyes and like it don't burn. Can you imagine that? I have to wash my face kind of rub twice. Put it all over. Okay, I'm gonna clean my facial cleanser off. After I go in with like a nice, and a nice bit of paper towel, and I dry my face completely dried. Um, I don't like to use my towel. I like to use like a fresh paper towel. It just makes sure no bacteria is on your face and it's just better. Um, keeps your face clean. You can actually see any dirt or anything that comes back on your face. So, you know, see? Paper towels are always better than using your towel, which you use on your body. And that's like my opinion, but if you check, a lot of people will agree on the same thing. So I'm just going to clean our eyes, clean thoroughly our face. For toner, I like to use that. I just picked this up, but it's the Dr. Teal's Witch Hazel Facial Toner. It's been, it's this rose water. It's been really good so far. And you can see how big the bottle is, like a lot. A little goes a long way, and look how big this bottle is. So, the tone I've been doing what it is supposed to do, honestly. I'm just gonna clean our face. 
Now that we're finished toning, next step is my discoloration correcting serum. I'm out, so I'm gonna have to pick up some when I go to Ulta. Um, and this is basically, like I like to put it on my face after I finish toning, like it helps with like, you see I have like a dark spot right here. Like my blemishes, like my dark spots. I like to put it on my face and that's what helps like even my dark spots off. Um, even my dark spots even out my dark spots, that's what I'm basically trying to say. It's done, so I have to like put it on my face like this and hope something comes out. There you go. Like it's nothing in this baby, okay? So you're gonna have to pick up some of that because it really helps. This goes miracle. This coloration from I really stand by it. I feel like this is like my sixth bottle. Like I go through so many bottles of this because it really, really works. So I'm gonna go ahead and just put that all over my hair. Oh, the new thing in my skincare routine that been holding your girl down with glowy skin is definitely the Lancome Advanced Genifique Serum. Like this serum is like the best. I feel like it makes my skin really hydrated, glowy. It makes my skin look younger, brighter, hydrate like I said. It hydrates plump and even not my skin tone. Um, and like it shows like within seven days of using it, you do see a difference in your skin, which I did. So I'm continuing using it. This was a gift, but I would definitely buy this again and keep on using it in my routine because I definitely do see a difference when I use it on my skin. Regular, like a regular serum, like so. And a little goes a long way. So you don't have to like put it a lot. And you can see like, look at my skin like already. I'm telling y'all, it's like the truth. Like it's really, really the truth. I really, really love using this. And it like, it helps with your makeup too. Like if you're gonna put on makeup, it really do help with your makeup of making it like last because it has like a tacky feel, similar to how a primer would. So yeah, it's the truth, y'all. I'm gonna finish with my skincare routine. I'm gonna go in with my Clean and Clear Duo Action Moisturizer. This is my go-to moisturizer. It helps fight pimples at the same time and acne. So it works for me. Um, put that on my face. Keep your skin like really moisturized. You you have oily skin, y'all. I feel like females or us who feel like we have oily skin, we're not supposed to over moisturize and you really should because it just makes your skin look very vibrant and you're going to produce oils regardless, but you really don't want dry skin. Dry skin is not cool. And of course, I'm going to end off with my black sunscreen, my black girl sunscreen. That'll be the last thing I end off because it is 102 degrees out here in Texas and <laughs> your girl needs to keep her skin even forever so we're gonna finish off with our sunscreen and basically i'm done basically recording my videos for this morning I'm about to make something to eat real quick and then I'm about to edit a video and I kind of have some wigs to ship out. Um, it's 11.48, 11.43, I'm trying to leave out the house by 1.30ish. So I'm gonna let my camera charge for a while because I kind of want to take it out with me because this is a day in the life. So let's I will let our camera charge so we can hit the streets and have a full battery. Okay, while well, I go edit my videos. I'm getting ready to fight. I don't care 
Especially if you want to grow like Instagram and stuff, I think it's best like when you're doing your makeup, hair, whatever you're doing, just get like short clips. That's what I'm learning right now. So anytime I do my makeup, my hair, and it may be repetitive, but that's what content is. Content is repetitive stuff over and over again. But I'm about to go get ready to go out. So I want to do like a five minute makeup base routine in a way. So that's what I'm putting now for the Insta. Graham. Um, I want to show you my setup. So this is how we are looking. Like so. I flim in this way. So like it's better to flim on Instagram. But yeah. That's it though. Can you guys see me better? This would just have to work. Okay. So let me make sure I am centered in the camera. And we're basically doing a five minute makeup routine. Um, so. This is a five minute makeup look because it literally took me like five minutes. I didn't use that much products at all, but it's literally giving makeup no makeup look. What y'all think? Comment in the comments. What y'all think it is? A five minute makeup look or makeup no makeup look? I don't know. But we got a full bar. I'm about to head. I'm about to head out. Yeah, this um y'all can't see it. I just had a pimple here. I put the Pimple patch by um, Peace Out Cosmetics. Yeah, it really hides your pimple like underneath your makeup. Like, it's bomb for real, for real. Okay, so let's hit the road. Let me take my garbage out. Houston heat makes no sense. Like, I mean, it makes no sense. It feels like I'm in the middle of a desert right now. I'm trying to adjust. Like, it is so hot. I think it's like in the hundreds. I believe it's in the hundreds, though. I'm about to go cancel my gym membership because I have not been here in like about four months. The money's coming out of my account, but I'm not going. So. But it's so nice in here. Every time I come in here to cancel it, I'd be like, do I really want to cancel it? Hi. I like to cancel my membership. Thank you. Perfect, thank you. All right, that was easy. I didn't have to do so much. On to UPS to ship my packages. I'm about to kill two birds with one stone because I'm about to do like some hygiene shopping. After I go to UPS, UPS is in the same circle. You know what I like about the South? I like that, like, they have, like, I don't know what you call it. It was, like, a little area, a little mall, 
Um, but it'd be like a little, it'd be like little malls and sections, and it'd be having so much different stores. Like New York is never like that, you know what I'm saying? So it'd be having like six, seven stores that you can actually go to within the same mall thing. If that makes sense, I don't know. Hi, can I get Hi. Your order? Mocha. Can I get a name? Mocha. M O C H A. And what would you like today? Can I get a small cup of ice, please? Small cup of ice, thank you. No. Okay, no? No. Okay, let's find out what you get. Thank you. Chick-fil-A ice, y'all. So let me tell y'all about Chick-fil-A ice if you don't know about Chick-fil-A ice. Chick-fil-A got the best ice. I know people be like, Sonic got the best ice. I never had Sonic ice, so I don't know what Sonic is hitting for. But Chick-fil-A ice, baby. Like, it, it's like, it's that ice that you can just crunch and eat. Like, it's so soft, it's light, it's small, it's crunchy. It reminds me of, like, a snow cone ice. You know how you can just eat snow cone ice? It's like that. I love Chick-fil-A ice. I be coming in the lines asking just for ice. They be like, that's it? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Appreciate it. I got my eyes. Oh. Mm. My mind be right. All these thoughts I'm traveling. Starting to give up my pain. Starting to be on my lane. My We got all the goodies today. I finally found a new body butter. I'm excited to show you guys. Um, but yeah, we went a little. We, we went crazy today. We didn't do. We didn't go so so crazy, but we went a little crazy. We went to Ulta. We went to Target. We went to Walmart. You know. We hit up all the places we said we was going to hit up, except Ulta, but Marshall's disappointed me, so, yeah, that part. All right, guys, I'm about to head home. My camera's about to die, so I'm going to get in the house, put it on the charger. I am back with me. I love my love. Y'all, yeah, my camera had died. But that ain't nothing new because my shit always dying. I'm about to let eat the rest of my leftovers. I do eat cold food. <laughs> mm. Relax, relax. Not all the time, but you know. But I'm really, really hungry. Just took a good shower. so good it's like it's like super refreshing one thing when I cook my food do not go to waste like I really be eating all my food mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. y'all like spending the day with me let me know how y'all feel about day in life or like you know daily vlogs um i kind of like this better because i just have to edit this video you know and i feel like it's much easier to like go about like recording because it's just one day versus you know having to edit for a whole entire week but 
um today was pretty cool like i had a pretty cool day today i feel like it was chill that's really like a day in a life with me like if i have to run errands i do that i didn't go to work today because today is monday but i'm gonna go to work tuesday thursday friday saturday i'm actually about to just chill and finish watching surrogates surrogacy surrogacy on netflix and it's basically the um the surrogate lady who was a surrogate for a married couple um if you don't know what i'm talking about it's called the surgency or the surrogacy something like that but tune into it like at first it was sort start of slow i fell asleep on it twice and i'm like yo this has too much good ratings for me to it has like too much of a high rating for me to be falling asleep. I don't know if I was too tired, but I actually started really watching it and it's really, really good. It's called The Surgency. I'm on I'm on an episode, I'm on the last episode right now. So I'm about to watch it and see what the tea is. Um, thank you guys for spending the day with me. Let me show you what my dinner is like though. I have mashed potatoes, salmon, some salad, and then I have jerk. Shredded chicken. This had I had this for like this is old, but it it goes nice with the mashed potatoes. So it's like just straight leftovers. <laughs> um, I like to, I I enjoy spending my day with you guys. We did a little shopping. We did some good skincare shopping, body care shopping. I'm not gonna show you what I got because it's gonna be in my next video. So make sure y'all tune into that to see what you girl got. But um. Yeah, I love y'all. Y'all know, y'all already know what the vibes is. I don't have to tell y'all all the time, but if I had to tell y'all all the time, I appreciate all you guys. My subbies are definitely going up. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I know some of you guys want to know a little bit about, a little bit more about me. Um, I do want to do a Q and A, but I'm trying to figure out should I do a Q and A? Like, how can I, like? Am I supposed to put it on Instagram and y'all like put the questions anonymous, anonymously or should I put it like on a post on YouTube on the community page and y'all can ask y'all questions? I don't know how I'm going to do it yet, but drop in the, um, drop in the comments like how y'all feel, how y'all think I should go about doing the Q&A so I can know what questions y'all want to ask me. Um, and that's really it, y'all. I had a good time with y'all. I'm going to keep on saying that. I had a good time with y'all. The Houston Heat ain't nothing to play with, but... We did a day in the life. And I love you guys. If you enjoyed the day in the life with me, you already know still, make sure you like. Talk to me in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next upload. I love y'all. Bye. And let me enjoy my little dinner and bye about for the rest of the night. Later, y'all. Bye. I met him in Philly and the name was Brown. Hey.